folks here at home are getting screwed by people in Washington. I'm running for Congress because we need more people in Washington punching back, fighting for us. I grew up in a working class family. When I wasn't in school, I waited tables at our family restaurant, I'm tired of Little League games, and learned many life lessons from the people in my neighborhood. I entered public service to fight for them. That's why I've taken on political insiders and special interests who tipped the scales against us. In the state legislature, I dedicated myself to making reforms, passed the Alternative Energy Act, and I worked to protect consumers by opposing payday lenders. As your Auditor General, I saved taxpayers hundreds of millions of dollars by exposing government waste, fraud, and abuse. My office uncovered thousands of rape kits that hadn't been tested. In 2016, the Auditor General's office found more than 3,200 rape kits, some dating back to the 90s, sitting in crime labs across the state untested. We cannot rest until the backlog is completely eliminated. We protected seniors from being abused in nursing homes. State Auditor General today released an audit that looks at the care received by Pennsylvania's 80,000 nursing home residents and found thousands of child abuse hotline calls going unanswered. State Auditor General Eugene Pasquale says that there have been an alarming number of unanswered calls recently at the statewide child abuse hotline. Any single one of those calls could have led to a life or death situation for a child. My public service career has been dedicated to reforming what's wrong and making things right. Not for the political insiders and special interests, but for us. Now I want to keep fighting for you in Congress. I believe everyone should have affordable health care and prescription drugs. We shouldn't deny climate change. We should plan for it. We have some flooding expected here along the Susquehanna. Education and trade school training are crucial to prepare people for high-skilled, better-paying jobs. And we deserve a level playing field, not a system stacked against us. With your help, we're gonna shake things up in Washington and punch back. Let's do this.